Akila. Akila. And okay. what brings you to me, Akila? Um, I've been following you for about a couple of months now, and I'm just in a space where I'm completely lost. And I think I need this reading tonight. Akila, why do I feel like you are outcasted by your family, or you feel outcasted by family? I do in a, in a certain way. That's coming through very strong. Mm -hmm. Why do I feel like I have like um, issues or, and it's very unnecessary issues. Um, it, it shouldn't be there, but yeah. And there's, it's, um, I feel very, uh, there's a female presence like instigating it. Does that make sense to you? Um, correct. To the point. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Hmm. Well, um, do you do you take on responsibility unnecessarily? Like, do you depend on control a lot? I do. Definitely, I take a lot of responsibility on. But you neglect yourself. You don't have time for yourself. You always have this thing no. like there's something to do, or there's there's something else to do, and. Um, you really, um, it's been a while since you've actually had a conversation with self, been one with self. Um, and if you ever com like talk to yourself, you complaining more than anything um, about things that's not going right or whatever. But I'm, I'm not really feeling a balance. I'm not feeling like the day where you just break the ice and say, you look good today. Are you kind yeah. of telling me, Daniel, I don't do that. And that feels weird. Like, who, why would I even say that to myself? She never talks to Correct. me like that. Correct. You literally telling me that I, I don't even see her. She doesn't talk to me. She doesn't spend time with me. She's always busy. There's always stuff to do. And she kind of neglects me. Like I'll bring up moments, but she feels awkward. She feels like ashamed of me. And this is you I'm talking about. Yes. No, I get you. I get you completely. It does Can you resonate with this? I do. 100%. Um, is is dad stern? Is dad like um, emotionally unavailable? No, my dad is actually very active. Um, no, I mean, um, uh, um, stern, strict. Um, no. Okay, cool. Who, who is there? Is there? Who's the male figure who feels very stern? Very someone close to you he feels very stern very strict very um dictator under my like you you um he rules with like an iron fist and it's like you can only go here you must be back here and, you know where have you i yes. feel very like autocratic kind of approach i won't say and... male i'll say female sorry just say that again i won't say male i will say more female Oh, okay. Yes. Your mother. Correct. <laughs> masculine energy. Very strong masculine energy. Very, very strong. Why am I also feeling like um, I'm the odd one out of, out of all the children? As a kid, you kind of like showing me like you the, you're standing like this and like everyone else is like, I don't know if you, if you have siblings, but I've, I feel like you're the odd one. I do have siblings and I've growing up I've always felt that way, yes. Like the um like the black sheep or you, you try but you you can't be general. You just the odd one. You're just different. Correct. Hmm. To the point. Okay. Wow. Well, this is only a short reading. Um mm -hmm. I hope I hope that gave you some sort of nice insight into what you're all about. I hope you enjoyed it. Indeed. I think I, I needed this and I needed to hear it as well. So thank you so much. I've been yearning to, to have a reading with you. So even though it was a short don't, one, thank you so much. Don't worry. 2020, 2021, the bookings are going to be open. I'm going to, I'm going to be able to, to take on a lot more readings, but. Yes, I'm definitely going to, I'm definitely going to book one for you. 
Definitely. Just be kinder to yourself. Please. Uh, Just I be will. A, a lot kinder to yourself. Even if it's something as simple as take your shoes off, take your socks off and just go walk in a park or something. But like, just wow. take time away. Like you're always making excuses of there's no time. Like time is this thing like, no, no, just relax, man. Just please just take time out for yourself. It's so on point. <laughs> please. Wow. And it's, I, I'm, I'm only saying this because I know it's hard to comprehend, but you telling me to tell you this, you, you telling me, please tell her to relax because she's not, She's burning herself out. She she feels that she's at the point where she's not coping, and no one's there to guide her and and tell her stop and relax because you know she doesn't have that kind of person around her. There's no one like that. Someone yes. needs to tell her relax, mm. and when someone tells her that and gives her that perspective, she then kind of says, "Okay, I get it. You're right." I think that's the reason why I've been so drawn to you for the past few weeks because I needed to hear that. <clears throat> okay. Well, I hope I, I I helped you guys, you and yourself, a little bit. Um, you did. I look forward to I look forward to doing a, a longer session with you. Thank you so much for coming Thank forward so with the receptive. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Take care. Bye. That's a nice reading. That was nice. I like that. I like that.